to do. You can do it in the grill also. Let's have a look at the ingredients. I have 500 grams of the boneless chicken. Now the boneless pieces I have made it like this. Okay, like bite sized pieces, big like this pieces. Nothing more than that please. Don't make it so big and keep it won't be good. And I have here 1 teaspoon of the pepper, quarter teaspoon of the turmeric powder, half teaspoon of the cumin powder and quarter teaspoon of the garam masala and 1 teaspoon of the coriander powder. We will add some salt needed for this. Okay. And half a lime. We have curd also coming, so don't have to add too much of mix. Now, in the meanwhile, I, what I have done is I have soaked about 12 pieces of the cashew in water for the last uh, 30 minutes. Okay, and what happened is the mix has got nicely soaked. So here, see, it's so nicely soaked here. In this jar what I have done is I have taken one cup of mint leaves, one cup of the coriander leaves, we are down here and I have added one third cup of the curd and then 12 pieces of the cashew and I am adding about 7 pieces of the green chilies and nice one piece of the ginger and about 6 pieces of the garlic. I am going to make this a fine paste and add on to that. Add the ground paste also into this mix. Okay. Ensure there's enough spice. Now I'm going to allow this marinate. If you want, if you don't want, if you don't like to add cashew here, you can add cream. Okay. Now I'm going to allow this marinate for four to five hours. Check your salt. No salt. Heated the pan here. I'm going to add in the marinated chicken pieces one after the other and cook it on a low flame. Now this is nicely done here. We'll fry both the sides and take it out. It's getting grilled very well. After we grill it and nicely cook the chicken, take it out. I have put all this into the baking tray. I'm going to grill it at about uh, 200 degrees and then take it out so this is how i have oil fried and i have taken it out inside so now i am just going to flip this this side also so that i'll get a nice dark brown effect on both the sides then i'll take it out we have made the hari hari chicken tikka try making you will enjoy this thank you for watching happy cooking happy eating bye bye